Hey guys, welcome back to the Daily Buzz. And right now it's all about summer travel. And here to go over some jet etiquette, or as they call it, jet etiquette, I have with me some travel experts, my good friends from the Savvy Stews. Good morning, guys. Thank you for good being morning. here. Good morning. Thank you for having us. You know, a lot of people are traveling throughout the summer. Yeah. What is what are some things that gets under under your nerves that you're like, you know, guys, stop it. That's enough. Leave your shoes on. Yeah. Leave your shoes on. Don't take your socks off. No. Especially don't take your shoes like and socks right off. Like this right here, look at this picture. Bathroom. People yeah. are putting their feet all over the place. We hear complaints from everyone. Even in first class, people are talking mm. about it. They're taking their shoes off. They're walking into the bathroom, this wet floors with Ooh. bare feet. It's and probably not water. Back, right, and then they're rubbing their feet on the back of your arm. <laughs> you're like a massage. That happen, and they're wiggling their toes. Ooh. It's gross. Really Is it okay to complain and tell the flight attendant, or should you tell you them yourself? Can. But why would you not want to handle it yourself? You know what I mean? You really you know, I mean, a little confrontation to get the day going. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, spice up like your travel me. experience a little bit. Yes, yeah. you're just like me. See what happens. Or take a picture and, and tweet it, you know, and That's shame them. The way to, that is a good way to do it shame these them. days. Yes. Why not? Put their picture out there for the whole world to yeah. see. <laughs> Somebody's going to recognize their feet. Ooh. Ooh. Somebody <laughs> might. Okay, let's go to tip that. number two. Okay. What's tip number two? You're trash. Okay. No, not you. But no, don't. Say, but don't leave okay. it anywhere. <laughs> yeah. Don't leave it anywhere in your seat. Don't leave it in your yeah. seat back pocket. Don't leave it on the floor. Don't step on crackers and leave it there. Don't just throw everything everywhere. No. Yeah, as people if you stuff the things in the seat back pockets, and you know that's the thing. Planes are landing and they're taking off again a few minutes later. There's no time for cleaners to get in there and mm -hmm. clean. In fact, right. the flight attendants end up cleaning a lot of the yeah. times during this, and they're reaching in and grabbing. <sighs> You know, who knows what. I've seen people cleaners. even leave diapers. Yes. Yeah. A lot I of mean, folks don't realize there are changing tables. They change the baby in the seat and just throw the diaper on the floor. Oh. Well, they think that everybody wants to touch their kids' stuff. That's not right. <laughs> that stuff. What is some of the weirdest stuff. thing you guys have ever found that you can say on air? Let me, let me clear. <laughs> well, you know what? <laughs> say, reaching a in there and finding one of those air sickness bags in that seat thing oh, that's been used. That's no. really sad. Mm -hmm. That's I, gross. I found underwear on a seat once. And you still have it. But you no, know what? Let's no, move no, on. No, All right. Don't. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. No. <laughs> Galen's like. All right, let's go to the next one. What's the third tip? The third tip is your appearance. Okay. You don't want to be doing your makeup on the plane, especially since, you know, there might be turbulence and who knows what you're going to look like when you're done you with it. You can get away with it, though. Yeah, I can't. Just, Jessica can, you know, but the rest of the world can't. You know no. what? You, this is the thing. <laughs> don't brush your hair. People don't realize that brushing your hair on the airplane like that, your hair is flying all over the place, mm -hmm. and it's gross. And then people are um, coming on with their their rollers, their rollers. on. Oh and yeah, stuff. we yeah. have. That they is, just roll out of bed and get right it's on an airplane. It's easy for us to say this. I have to say, when you know guys have it easy, we just right. get, you know. But do you I mean, get treated better if you dress up a little do. bit? You do. You do. And if and if you actually compliment the flight attendants and thank them, uh -huh. if you even say the words thank you, you'll yeah. be treated better. Ah, this good is one. This is scientific information. Oh, I see. <laughs> All right. How about the kids? Uh, just watch after your kids. You know, we love children. We just love. You sound children. Like, <laughs> but you know, but, like look at this yeah. picture. Look at this picture. Like this Hershey's cocoa is all over the floor because the parent fell asleep mm -hmm. and the kids needed something to play with. Right. And this is what happened. Cocoa oh. all over. Do you know how much, tr how hard that is to get up? I mean, that plane probably was put out of service. It's probably what? delayed for, for <laughs> no. quite, quite a That's while. That's the so. cause of the delay. All right, how about people who carry too many things? You know, it's like five carry-on. That's big. This is, you may have already heard about this. This carry-on shaming thing has gotten Ooh. really big, and it's people that come on and take over the whole overhead bin so that the last people that come mm -hmm. on the plane have nowhere to put their bags. Right. So They're one of my favorite things Galen always says is treat the overhead bin as if it's taxable real estate. Oh wow! See, <laughs> so, so you guys, you know, you, you we talked about this last night. We, we, we met up, but um, shaming people and putting it yeah. online. What's that hashtag that people are passenger are, shaming passenger and also sh carry on shame? Oh my god! And then flying feet. Flying feet's another wow. one. Wow, that's how you shame. One. Yeah, it gets around. Let me just tell you something. There's a whole underground. Yeah, uh -huh. people that are talking about this stuff and looking. You guys have a show members. coming up October second. Yeah, it starts do. really quick. Uh, October second, Destination America, take off with the Savvy Stews, travel the world with us, and Jessica comes with us. Oh, nice.